You have to take what he said with a grain of salt and use it in your own life experiences and pull out the positive you see that you can use to better yourself and cast away the negative. You can't allow one man that you know nothing of other than on YouTube to get you in a space to where you hate him so much you wish him death. The hypocrisy amongst a lot of people is ridiculous. Your cousin and your brother Ray Ray and them can kill a bunch of niggas in the hood and they go to jail and y'all talking about free Ray Ray and them. But here's a man just speaking his opinion and you wish death upon him. That's ridiculous. And y'all need to grow the fuck up. Now, did I agree with everything Kevin Samuel said? Fuck no. I think half of the shit he was saying was bullshit, honestly. The other half had some truth bearing in it, honestly. But 50% of that shit, look, I low-key took him for a comedian. I didn't think a lot of shit he was saying he was he even believed in, y'all. If you look at a lot of shit he was saying, half the time he was laughing and smirking when he was saying it. When he was talking about that big Shirley and, you know, playing the horns, dying alone and get yourself a dog. All that shit was entertainment factor. A lot of women took that shit serious, which I didn't understand. Look, there's no way he can honestly say that a 35-year-old woman with three kids, three baby daddies ain't never going to have shit. How the fuck would he know that? He just a person, y'all. Y'all was taking what he said way too fucking serious. Like, real talk. Now, I want to send my condolences to his family, his mom, and, and if he had siblings and cousins and everybody. Condolences to Kevin Samuel's family because nobody... I don't wish death on nobody, y'all. I done lost my mama, my son and got killed. I done lost 28 of my friends, murdered in the streets of Oakland. I don't wish death on nobody because once you once you get into the death game, it's over, game over. You ain't got no chance to repent or come back from any harm you've done to people. The game is to stay alive, y'all. The game is to stay alive. When y'all hear me talk about health and wealth and I work out seven days a week and stuff like that because as long as I'm in the game, I can change. As long as I'm in the, the game, I could be a better person for me, myself, my family, and y'all and drop some knowledge on y'all to hopefully help one of y'all change y'all lives. I think in the end, that's all Kevin Samuels was trying to do, in my opinion. I think he was actually really trying to help. He just said it harshly and not in the way that most people are used to hearing it. But I think, honestly, he was just trying to help. He was just trying to help. Same thing I'm trying to do. My videos I'm making, I'm just trying to help y'all straight up so once again i love y'all i want to see y'all thrive peace thanks for supporting me